Hey everybody, Edward here with Springsteen TV. Today we're gonna to be checking out some stores in the Oklahoma City area. First, we're gonna be checking out a Barnes & Noble. I've never shopped at a Barnes & Noble. I didn't even know they carried action figures and pops, so we're gonna go in, check that out, see what they got. Um, after that, we're gonna hit up a Toy Base 10. It's the local Oklahoma City toy store. He's a, he's a, a reseller. I don't think he collects himself. He just, he just resells. But he's, he has awesome prices. Um, he's very nice. So we're going to go check that out. Probably maybe a Target, uh, maybe a GameStop. We're not sure. Not uh, looking for anything in particular. Just just out getting, you know, just Funko hunting. Don't even know what we're looking for. Just hunting. Uh, we might stumble across something good. We might not. If you watched the last video, I already got some awesome pops thanks to my dad and brother. Right, we're going to head to this Barnes & Noble, and I'll get you back on as soon as we get in. Okay, so she made it to this Barnes & Noble. Let's go in and check it out. Okay, so it looks like here all their pops are kept behind the registers. Okay, so I was wrong. Not all the pops are behind the register. There are some up here. They do have a few more of their New York Comic Con exclusives. Looks like some San Diego ones. Kind of like this. Everywhere I go, I didn't have music just blasting on the radio. Okay, so just got out of Barnes & Noble. Um, I, I haven't, you know, obviously watched the video back yet. There's a lot of music blasting in the Funko area. If there's music over it, that's why. Got my tea. Didn't really find anything I wanted. So we're gonna head to the next spot and hopefully have better luck. All right, so just parked the Toy Biz 10. Let's go ahead and head in and see what we can find. Okay, so here in the Funko room, he has plenty to look at. Sorry, my voice is <coughs> kind of cracking. Plenty to look at, walls filled. We're in here looking at stuff, Mia. Red tar. I feel like that's old. Ariel. Rapunzel. Cinderella. Electra. Finn. Nothing there. War Machine. Uh, Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. My box is pretty banged up on that. Let's see. 
Where's another reptile? It's a chase. Does this count as finding a chase in the wild? Maybe captured, put in a sanctuary? Oh, I don't know. Uh, if the price is good on this, I'm definitely going to get this. So I'm going to put this to the side. Let's see what else we can find. No. No. Definitely not. Hmm. Might be good. I feel like a protector would straighten that out, but I'll have to look that one up in a second. Smurfit. Kind of Ursula. Oh. I feel like that's. Is that custom? That's. That's a new I make love and I seen there was Seth where there's Seth right up there. <coughs> See Jack and oh no, that box is disgusting. Power Rangers. No no. I don't really see much else I don't think I can live with. Wait, hold on. Poe seems kinda interesting. But I think my main focus is gonna be this I'm gonna see how much this is and this may be the only thing unless I find something else wait a minute this is kind of cool I know I say I don't like the solid colors but the do it yourself is pretty cool I wouldn't I wouldn't paint it I would just leave it like that that's really cool I wonder how much that is I think I'm gonna go up front and check so uh I'll get back with you guys as soon as I find something out. Could not leave Toy Base 10 without checking out my favorite room. The horror themed room, horror and sci-fi, if you will. Um, they have a few pops in here, but there's a couple that we've seen over there. Like this and that, but I'm interested in that. He has the Jason that I've been wanting, but... I think I'm still gonna have to wait on this. Just, just putting it off for some reason. I just want the horror icons for NECA, not all of them. Like I, I had so many. I had all the Predators and everything, but I'm only gonna do like Jason, Freddy, Michael. Oh, update on this. He said ten dollars, so I'm picking up a Chase Reptar for ten bucks. Awesome score. Let's keep looking. Check in. That's an awesome two pack. What is this? Uh, oh, it's Pennywise. There's the Christmas two pack of Gremlins. Just sold my Gremlins, so that'd be unnecessary. I'm going to make a quick walk through to the rest of the store and see if there's any other pops hidden somewhere. I'm really happy I found this. Ten bucks. Couldn't pass it. Let's go to the next room. Got a couple more pops. Not really much I'm looking for, but just thought I'd show you anyway. Keep going. Star Wars room. Those are cool. The last time I was here, he had a three pack of, uh, I forgot which ones, but I know Wicket was in there for sure. Uh, it was Funko Pops, but it was the Ewok set. Should have got it when he had it the first time. Kind of bummed I missed out on that. There's Grandpa. And Edward. And Shaft and the Headless Horseman. Well, I kind of made it through the store already, so I think I'm going to check out and head to the next spot. 
Let's go. Okay, so I just passed a half price books. I'm gonna turn around and go check that out. Uh, the last time I was in the Dallas area for Fan Expo, they had figures and pops in there. I guess you can sell your figures there. So I'm gonna turn back around and go check out half price books. See if maybe we'll get lucky like we did in Toy Base 10, something older. Okay, so just parked the car, heading into Half Price Books, but there is also a Michaels right next door. So I'm probably gonna go to Michaels after Half Price Books. Let's go see what they got. All right, so at first glance, looks like all they have are Dobby and Hedwig from Harry Potter, and those five stars, and some, I believe they're keychains. Yeah, little pop keychains. I don't see anything else here, but we're gonna go ahead and look around and see if I can find something else. So at first glance, I missed it and walked right past it. They do have a few, looks like they're Halloween theme pops. There's a Coraline Max, I got that already. Gage, I want, but I, I just haven't got it yet. And they got Scary Terry. Now, I don't watch Rick and Morty, but clearly you can tell who this is uh, resembling. So, this could be something I get. I'm not 100% sure on that yet. Well, that's pretty cool. These are the only pops that I've seen other than what I showed you when we first got in. So, I'm going to walk around with this in my hand just in case. Uh, we may or may not get it. This could be an on and off type video here since they're seeming to be just popping up in displays. I don't think they have their own set area, so we're going to keep looking. So came across the superhero section. See comics. I think right over here I see got one Marvel Legend, a Diamond Select, a Flux Game. Oh, some pops. Let's see what we got. Ooh, they got Harley Quinn. Come on. Alright. Now the hands free. Let's see Johnny Cash. Whoever Jim is. Oh, that's that one group. I don't care about that. The Mickey with water buckets. Judy Hopps, Harley Quinn. I love Harley Quinn. Specifically this one. Just because the actress. Um, let's see, Isabel. Ariel. I, I don't see anything special in particular that stands out. Other than the 10 inch Ursula. They have some loose ones. Here we got, got some Lucy's. Uh, don't know, Killer Croc, Thanos, Star Wars, Star Wars. I think we're still gonna stick with the Scary Terry. Okay, so just walking out of Half Price Books. I'm a very indecisive person. I decided not to get Scary Terry. I'm gonna go in here and see what they got. Maybe they have the uh, Michaels exclusive Frozen Pops. We're gonna go inside and check it out. After walking around a little, found it. Somebody's trying to get a peek at the mystery boxes. Father Gabriel. Dewey. The ancient one. I'm not really playing, playing crazy. Ooh. Ooh, Rosita. I do like some Rosita. Rosita might be good though. 
I'm gonna take on this. Mm -hmm. I think she won't do much. Mm -hmm. Let me check the price for this. She was in a clearance area, so she may be $7.97. Okay, so no frozen pops, and Rosita was still $14. bucks. i am not paying that. Um, we're going to head out. I'm not guaranteeing Target, but we'll end up there at some point. All right, so in typical Edward fashion, we did not go to Target. We are at a vintage stock. I would show you the sign, but this car's kind of blocking me. So we're gonna head in. I'm gonna look at the pops, see what they got. They they, they buy uh, you know people's pops they don't want. So maybe they have something like the Reptar. I'm still excited about the Reptar. Let's go in and check it out. Just got out of vintage stock. I was gonna get dark. I uh, got to the register. They said he was 12 bucks instead of the 5.99 sticker that was on him. So I, I, of course, put that down. I was not paying that much for that. It's a cool pop. I like strange things, but I'm not paying that much for a pop that's not worth that much. All right, guys. So we we are now officially heading to Target. I know this whole video I've been saying we're going to Target. Finally heading to Target. Hopefully they have something. You know, it's been quite a buildup going to Target. So we're gonna go there, um, right right down the road from Target is a GameStop, so we're gonna stop there right after. Hope we find something cool. If not, it's been fun, guys. All right, I don't know if you can see the sign right over there. We're finally here at Target. Let's go in and see what's popping. Just, just getting in here, it looks like they have the 10 inch Boba Fett. These are really cool, just not something I want. Here's some of the Star Wars stuff. Funko Pops. Uh, it's got BBA, Dio, Ray, Kylo Ren. Is that the whole set? No, that is not the whole set. Oh, let's go further back into the Funko area. We're heading over there. Funko Wall. And just at first glance, I don't see anything I'm interested in. That's so why we gotta look around, look up top. Okay, I got these chrome jokers. Junk Uncle. Um, oh, Westbrook. Nobody likes him anyway. And this is, I didn't like him before he left Oklahoma City in that trade, just so you know. High hopes, guys, but well, this box looks good. 
Might get that. Maybe. We'll see. I don't really see anything that I can't live without. What is this? Teen Titans? No. It's the Black Crown Joker. These rock candies. I wish they had a people other than Elsa and on. They don't. Ooh! That is what I need. This is what I'm getting. It's got a 10 inch Ezra, not really interested in that. This is an awesome score though. So glad I found this finally, it's the only one they got. Oh, my collection for Haunted Mansion is done. My set is completed now. Just wanna show you guys real quick what they have on clearance. They have a lot of these Dennis Nedry's, three of them, 626 each. It's not something I'm interested in. And oh, I guess because this box is all banged up. $7.71. And some fig pins. There's no prices on them, but if you like Dragon Ball Z or Kingdom Hearts, those are good. Get my Madame Leota and get out of here. Off to GameStop. Okay, we've made it to our final stop on this pop hunt. We are at GameStop. We just parked. About to head in. Let's go see what they got. They have a sale table right here we want to look through first. You know, just for something we may, may want. This means two for ten, so. It's not bad of a deal, right? Two pouch, ten bucks. Mm, it's pink. I feel like this will be easier. I think of Corey and Topanga. There's Corey. Let's go to the Clarence area. Oh, these fall under that too. Ooh. I just don't. Just don't see much that I'm interested in. That's why it's two for ten, right? Brady Bunch. Trash. Got more Funko Pops here. Looks like this is more newer stuff. Well, I'm not sure. Cheat is pretty cool. Man. And so before we go to the wall, I turned around and they have these awesome Sub Zero from McFarlane. I'd like to get it, but this one looks cross eyed. I don't know if y'all can see that. On that little detail is going to bother me. This might be worth picking up. I seen that I believe on the 30th the Scorpion will come out, so I might pick them up both then. But right now, I'm gonna wait. Ah. No, my luck, they'll be all gone by the time I want them. All right, here at the wall. So let's see. Oh, they got the Rob Zombie. Awesome pop. Love it. Maleficent. Trish Stratus. Star Wars.
Wars, Dragon Ball. No, no. Hmm. Maybe. Haven't seen the movie yet, so that's maybe when I see it. <laughs> Piccolo, no, no, Sven. Ooh, they got Sven. Possibly. Hold this squat. Getting a workout trying to show this stuff. I don't see much else. Wondering about this earth giant. This thing is heavy. Wow, that really is heavy. Check out over here. I don't, I don't watch anime, but for you guys that do, I care about y'all too, you know. Toy collector, toy collector. Gotta show y'all love. Go to Borderlands, Fortnite, Dark Souls. These are tiny. Marvel Legends. It's a cool two pack down there. The Deadpool and Hit Monkey. Okay, so after looking around, we found nothing. We're gonna head out. Okay, so I just got home. I want to thank everybody for watching, subscribing. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you like the channel, hit the bell so you know when I post more videos. I gotta find a spot up here to put these two in. I gotta organize some stuff out. Um, thanks everybody for supporting, follow on Instagram, and until next time, y'all have a good night.